what is going on YouTube fascinating graveyard here today at the Woodlawn Cemetery here in Houston Texas on this uh, quiet Sunday evening the Sun is about to go down right now and it is a nice temperature to walk around in after today being so hot being about 85 degrees anyways so today i'm going to visit the grave of melinda d taylor a gorgeous woman uh, she was the uh, penthouse playmate of the month in april of 1998 so Melinda also she did some adult movies uh in her career uh I wouldn't say she was a big time adult movie actress but she did do some she was on the Howard Stern show a couple times I was having a hard time uh, finding the episode that she was on and uh weirdly enough uh she has said in a I believe an interview that uh, she uh, was, because uh, for a while she was an escort and she was probably, you know, popular with the Hollywood elitist or what have you. And Charlie Sheen, uh, she claimed that was a one of her uh, clients. And I had a hard time doing this video because I just didn't want to come to a grave of, a, you know, a pretty girl who, you know, did you know adult movies or whatever and i'm not a psychologist and i always wonder to myself uh, what kind of person would want to do adult movies now sometimes you might actually enjoy your work and other times not so much and you cover up uh the act of whatever it is that you're doing by masking it with doing a lot of drugs and drinking a lot of alcohol and that is what uh, melinda did uh she performed other un, under the name of chloe jones and uh, like a lot of pornographic actresses um a lot of them do uh do drugs and uh it's just uh it's not a uh natural um thing that a woman would want to do guys different you know guy would do it sure you pay him 50 bucks why not you know but a woman, you know, they get paid a lot more. But in my personal opinion, not worth the money. But maybe they do it for the notoriety. Maybe they do it for the fame. Maybe they do it because, you know, something bad happened to them in their past. I don't know. I would find, uh, I'd be hard pressed to guess that a woman who does adult movies had a normal upbringing. A lot of times, uh, girls that go into that kind of lifestyle, uh, or, you know, something happened in their life, some abuse of some form or another. So anyways, uh, this is the grave of Melinda D. Taylor. And um, she died about two weeks before she was going to turn 30 years of age. Uh, she died of uh, liver failure. Uh, she had a very, very... Uh, heavy uh, prescription pill addiction along with alcohol uh, this woman was very 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 pretty very very pretty and uh, she is just but uh, one of many people that have lived their lives and now they are here and uh, originally she was born uh, a little bit south here uh I forgot what part of Texas she's at. It's not Galveston, but it's the east of Galveston. It's in that, that next to the port areas. And she had moved to uh, Los Angeles to be an actress. And, you know, it's, it's, it's like winning the lottery when you go out there, if you ever become an, a paid actor or actress. And, um, you know, and I mean, she did make some money out there. Unfortunately, it probably wasn't the way in, uh, in which uh, she wanted to do so. But, um, you know, hey, you know, we all live our lives and we do the best that we can. And, um, 
You know, I, I feel kind of bad for this girl, you know, so young. So young and not even 30 years old. And, you know, when it comes to, you know, liver disease, it just sneaks up on you. It ain't something like one day, you know, you're not feeling good. It's one day you're not feeling good. It's because your liver is failing. And that's a lot of times is when it's too late. So rest in peace to Melinda D. Taylor. Uh, very, very young. And that's why I always say, guys, don't do drugs. I, I know I sound like an old man when I say that. I sound like one of, you know, McGruff the crime dog. But, um, you know, drugs are a very, very bad thing. It, uh, it rips families apart, destroys lives, takes lives. And it uh, sadly took hers. So rest in peace to that young lady. Okay, guys. I am out of here. I will see you on the next vlog. Be good, y'all. Peace out.